Ready to go. Interview with Dabby. Yeah. Interview. And okay, Steve. guys. Happy face. So the theme for the festival this year is Celtic myths and legends and a lot of the events happening around Bunflody will be themed around that and our parade is themed around Queen Maeve who of course is a legendary Irish warrior queen and the parade is actually going to represent the cattle raid of Cooley. As we come through Bunflody you're going to see the Queen Maeve's warriors and the King of Ulster battling it out and they'll lead to a finale at the end when the two bulls, which the whole thing is about, uh, will face off and battle each other. So my role has been lead artist on the previous two projects and this one as well. I'm helping guide people and making decisions about what we're going to make and what kind of form it's going to take. I first met John King uh, working on a creative communities project here in Bunclody about three years ago. So this is our third year creating work for the Streams of Bunclody Festival. And John King has been working through ArtBank and now is the festival director for Bunclody Festivals. And we've been lucky enough to get a small bit of funding through Creative Ireland and John has found funding through other sources as well to help us work at this. But we have a huge team of people who are volunteering and giving their time here in Liam's Shed. And uh, it's down to all the people who are actually getting involved that makes it all happen. typecast this year because of my name. Uh, my name is Maeve, so I'm playing Queen Maeve. And I was told that I was going to be the King of Ulster because apparently there was a conversation where like, well, what can Katie do? It's a great way to get to know people in the community and in the area. It's really good fun, a really way, good way of blending and mixing with different people. Well, I've been involved for the last three years in the workshop. Uh, I was involved in the creature making workshop first, and then I was involved last year in the Queen of Hearts parade. And um, it's been absolutely great fun. Uh, we have people of all ages, from kids of 10, 12 years old, up to um, people in their 60s, even 70s. And everybody gets on great. And it's, it's good fun, if nothing else, the fun is worth coming for. It 
it's for the first time they're going to see the, the uh, battle radar Cahooli actually being portrayed in front of them as opposed to reading it out of a book. Well, I'm hoping the audience will enjoy it, that they will take part. We've got two opposing sides, so I'd really hope that they come on board and start cheering from one side to the other. I'm wondering who they're going to cheer for, whether it's going to be Queen Maeve or the High King of Ulster. We've got two family members playing those roles, so it'll be really interesting to see uh, which side people go to. It could get, could get a bit political. <laughs> well, um, what we'd be looking forward to is... Probably killing you. Um, yeah, I suppose that'd be fun. <laughs> um, like to kill each other, but it should be a good day out of the day.